Hello friends, welcome to the DJ Voice channel. You all have come here with the latest and important updates. So the friend will watch the video till the end. And if you are new to the channel, then you must subscribe to the channel. You will subscribe and click on the bell option given. Along with it to turn it on. Read about the latest updates. Tory MPs critical of Rishi Sunak's leadership are hoping he will stand down voluntarily to avoid the spectacle of a damaging coup and are looking to May's local elections as a potential crunch point. The Guardian has been told, a former minister said several Conservative MPs had contacted Graham. Brady, who heads the 1920 to Committee of Backbench Tories, to say they want the Prime Minister to quit, but that they had not sent in letters of no confidence yet, the former minister said. They believe Sunak's Downing Street was too complacent about the risk he faces. After no new public challenges emerged after to heavy by-election defeats for the party. This week, number 10 think they're not in much trouble at all over a leadership challenge. Which feels a bit arrogant, they said. Quite a lot of moderate MPs now agree with the traditional anti-Rishi. Types to say that the best course of action is not for us to remove him, but for him to stand down voluntarily. And they're speaking to Graham Brady about it. That's why you're not hearing much noise about it. I know it's happening. The magnitude of it is difficult to say. It avoids the pain of removing a PM and might even prevent a protracted leadership contest. If one person emerges as a successor, like Rishi did, the situation was less like the removal of Boris Johnson, they said, than a slower motion and less contentious Liz Truss. It's not that they think Rishi's terrible, like she was, but he's had a go for 18 months and the plan isn't working. They said, since Labour won the Kingswood and Wellingborough seats, overturning sizeable Conservative majorities, Sunak has faced renewed calls from some of his MPs to tack further to the right on areas such as immigration and tax cuts, especially after Reform UK, formed by Nigel Farage, won 10% plus of the vote in both contests. So friend, this was some latest and important update which was very important to share with you guys. Hope you like our latest update today. See you in next update. Till then give us permission. Thanks for watching.